Okay, so as cosec theta over two is root 10 over three, then we know that sine of theta over two is one over that, which is three over root 10. I find these easiest by drawing a nice little triangle like this, uh, where we have that here is theta over two, which is three root 10, then by Pythagoras, this is one. So we know that cos of theta over two, just reading it off the triangle, is one over root 10. So therefore using the sine double angle, we have that sine theta is two times cos theta over two times sine theta over two, which equals six over 10. Now we can draw another little triangle here. And we can put the theta in here, so that would be six and that would be 10. So by Pythagoras, this will be eight. Now all we need to do now is read them off. Now sec theta is one over cos. So sec of theta here, is equal to 10 over 8 and tan theta is equal to 6 over 8 just reading from the triangle therefore sec times tan is 10 over 8 times 6 over 8 which is 60 over 64 which is 15 over 16 which is answer E.